So you are welcome to the official relaunch of Core Mixture. If you recall, Core Mixture has gone through a lot of research, which publications have been captured in a lot of international journals. But today, at the Alisa Hotel in Accra, we are gathered here to hear from some of the scientists and researchers who have worked on Core Mixture. We have some of our researchers coming from South Africa, some from the Centre for Plant Medicine Research, Mampong, and then those who are part of the company. I'm talking about the Core Research and Manufacturing Company Limited. And so we have... Uh, representation from the Ghana Medical Association. We have representation from the Ghana Association of Medical Herbalists. We have representation from GAFTRAM, that is the Ghana Federation of Traditional Medicine Practitioners. And of course, we have a highly powered delegation from Minshia under the distinguished patronage of Otum Fawcett to the second. Very soon I'll be engaging some of our participants to share their experiences with us as far as Kwa Mixture is concerned. Hey, what's up, everybody? Thank you for checking me out. My name is Eko Simpson. I'm a Ghanaian, um, and I live in Ghana. Well, you are watching this channel because somebody introduced you to it. It was recommended or suggested to you on YouTube. To the relaunch of Kwa Mixture, and a medicine that has brought the link to many individuals, and families over the years. It is heartwarming to see distinguished personalities in the area of science and research that we hear this morning. This gives a testament to the fact that Kwanisha has indeed touched many lives. Nana Chairman, relaunch of Kwa mixture has been associated by few developments in recent times. Much of the board and the management have been up to the task in living up to the expectation of clients. We also see it as a duty to bring medical practitioners and influential personalities like you together and Together to enable you appreciate the investment made as far as research and with respect to Kua is concerned. We shall soon be listening to various presentations from our experts, both in Ghana and South Africa, regarding their research on this wonderful product. The Kua RMCL is committed to the growth and development of plant medicine. During the course of this program, we shall demonstrate that commitment. Once again, I welcome you all to this August event and may God richly bless you. We'll be seeing you shortly. It's there in the corner. Keep your eyes on the prize, which is the bottle, Koa Mixture Reloaded. The medicine that works. And Nana is known in private life as Professor Edward Pidgey. He's a professor at a KNUSD, a very learned man, of course, and a supporter for a thousand acres of land to be celebrated. Yes, certainly. We thank you very much. You can also watch the LED screens that are mounted as the unveiling happens. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. There you have it.
new core mixture reloaded, then let's say that works. There you have it. You know what, Splendor? Improve core mixture reloaded. The best thing. All too soon, the program has come to an end here at Alisa Hotel, where we saw the relaunch of Koa Mixture. I'm uh, Dr. Anthony Mensa, President of Ghana Association of Medical Herbalists. Yeah, so Ghana Association of Medical Herbalists are uh, uh, the, the, the group of doctors who have been trained at the university to be able to understand herbal medicines, understand orthodox medicines, understand indigenous practice of herbal medicines, and be able to bring all of that knowledge together to better the practice of herbal medicines in Ghana mm. and beyond. Mm. Uh, this has been the dream of the Ministry of Health, uh, because over the years, Ghana has spent some time on developing scientifically proven herbal medicines and manufacturing same for uh, registration by the FDA and for certification for use. Okay. So Dr. Mensa, what has been your impression from the presentations that came so far? Well, uh, I wasn't expecting anything different. Uh, I think that the presentations have thrown more light on what we've always believed COA to be, the quality, the scientifically proven evidence-based uh, you know, research to herbal medicine that COA stands for. And I think that the presentations even uh, have thrown more light to that. And it gives us more confidence mm. to prescribe same uh, to our patients and, and clients who will come for our services. Usually, you give it as an adjuvant to most of the treatment lines we've been doing. We make a diagnosis of, say, hypertension, diabetes, and some viral infections and other diseases that we manage at the hospitals. What happens is that you give COA and the treatment is even faster and better. Professor Alex Asase. Yes, please. And uh, from... Oh, I am the executive director of the Center for Plant Medicine Research. How do you feel listening to the presentations that came this morning? Well, I might say I am really fulfilled because as a center for plant medicine research, our vision is to make sure that herbal medicine becomes a natural choice for uh, everyone. And uh, not just a choice, but it must be go through a scientific process to make it rigorous so that people can be saved and people can receive the benefits from the herbal medicine. And I must say that COA mixture has gone through this process, which makes me fulfilled. Thank you. And we have a lot of people with experiences as far as the product is concerned. Many people are sharing experiences that uh, is so awe inspiring. But then uh, there is one man here I would like to talk to. How are you, sir? I'm fine. Uh, what's your name? My name is Emmanuel Brown. Mr. Emmanuel Brown. Yeah. Uh, how long have you been using Kua Mixture? 2019. 2019. Yeah. Uh, tell me, what was happening to you? How did you get in touch with uh, Kua Mixture? By then, I have an old rat, four old rats. And always I'll be going to the cardio checkup, always. But still, I don't see improvements. But someone introduced the poor mister to me. Even I refuse to take it, but I see it as a, just water. But my wife forced me to start using it. So I take one bottle, two bottles. Then I see that the, the, the things change. If I work small, I had to boil in a can all the bucket of water. But I started using the Kua, two bottles. Then I see the changes. Now I've been doing the things men do. I work fast, I do everything. Then I say no. Then I stop going to the checkup since July. Uh, uh, July 16, July 1919. I started going. So I started using the Kua. Kua Mr. Every month I take two bottles, which is less than for me. For a, less than for me, I like more than I go to the hospital. If I go to the hospital, I spend more than I use the power. So since for 19, 2019, I'll be a checkup. I'll be using the power right now. But we want to issue a disclaimer that the COA is not for the treatment of any particular condition. 
But then it is important that when you take it for your general well-being, it helps. Mr. Brown, thank you very much for sharing this experience with us. So we are in for scientifically proving herbal medicines. Mm. So uh, for the relaunch of CoA, we are here to support uh, the relaunch of CoA because we all know how the product is and we've been using it, we've been prescribing it to our patients. So if there is a relaunch for CoA that we are well aware of, I think it's good for us to support uh, with such a program. I see. Now, can you share with me some of the specific experience or encounter that you've had with Koa Mixture? Yeah, uh, personally, you know, Koa has been in existence for quite some time now. We've been using it, and uh, personally, yeah, I've used it uh, to, to manage people with hepatitis B. Okay. Uh, the first encounter was uh, someone who was uh, traveling outside the country. They did a viral load. It was, I think, more than 5 million copies of the hepatitis B virus. After three months' administration of the uh, Koa mixture, at that time it was Koa FS. So after three months' administration, the person went back to repeat the viral load and it had dropped drastically. So uh, I can say that personally, that's the experience I've had. And people with diabetes, especially, they are some on their orthodox medication. When you add Koa to it, that's the experience I've had. When you add Koa to it, it's able to reduce the sugar levels. So the sugar levels are able to uh, reduce well and, 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 and it's well managed in that area. I see. Koa mixture is a plant medicine. It's a 100% herbal extract. Now, it is registered by the FDA for general well-being and not for the cure of any particular condition. I want to put it on record that Koa mixture is not registered for any for the treatment of any particular condition however it has been registered for general well-being and so children under 12 years are not supposed to take it pregnant women are not supposed to take it lactating mothers are not supposed to take it but apart from that whatever condition you have you can use qua mixture to support that treatment also for those of us who want to keep fit, you know, you want to live healthy, Koa Mixture is the medicine for you.